Uh, good afternoon. I want to thank everyone for being here this afternoon. My name is Pete von Reitbar, and on behalf of the King County Council, I'm here to recognize the lifeguards for King County. There have been over 200 records broken in this facility, 200 records broken at the King County Aquatic Center. But today we're going to recognize one award-winning performance, and that's by these individuals here particularly these two right here were the primary rescuers. This facility has set records. They've had the greatest swimmers, Michael Phelps. I've seen Michael Phelps swim here. But also as important is the high schools and colleges and recreational sports also come here. And this is a very safe facility because of these people here. This is one of the greatest facilities in the entire United States for diving and swimming. And it's a great recreational facility. But no matter if it's Michael Phelps or the young person from Tacoma who they rescued, everybody feels safe here because of these people here who are lifeguards. I want to bring forward Ivy and Brian, first of all, to share that moment that they did, and then I'm going to make presentations. So Ivy, what happened that night? Um, yeah, so I was guarding in another chair and I saw that Brian needed help. We all played a really important part in this, and I'm very glad that we had mentorship who came very quickly and people that we can, that were able to assist us. And we work together as a team. Excellent, Brian? Um, I was on that chair right behind us on the competition pool when I noticed a swimmer in distress. Um, I jumped in, swam after him, and then pulled him out of the water where this amazing team behind me and Ivy <laughs> um, were able to save his life. Excellent. Uh, any questions you might have of these right now before we make a presentation? Any questions? Well, first of all, I want to thank both you and all the team behind you. And like so much about King County, it's a team effort. It's not one individual or two individuals. Everybody here played a role in mentorship and organization and skills. And we're really happy that many of the family members are here to watch their children be recognized. So on behalf of the King County Council, I'd like to present each of you this proclamation. And I'll hand it off to you. Then I'll read it once I've handed it to you. Brian, would you do me a favor yeah, pass this down? Yeah. Make sure everybody gets one. We give out certificates in lieu of property tax relief. <laughs> we got one. And one more. Everybody got it? Good. Uh, whereas the Warehouser King County Aquatic Center opened in 1990 to host the aquatic events of the Goodwill Games, and since then has become nationally recognized as one of the world's finest aquatic centers. And whereas in addition to holding collegiate and Olympic competition, the center is also a safe place for the community to take lessons in swimming and diving for athletes in practice and to be open to the public for recreation. Whereas on June 15th, 2024, a young athlete competing in the Cannonball Classic suddenly stopped swimming in the middle of his heat and lifeguard Brian Mazuka had to perform a water rescue. Whereas several lifeguards helped with this rescue, administering CPR and applying AED while other staff uh, secured the area, appropriate calls and generally uh, came together to rescue this young man. Whereas the athlete was unconscious when EMT took him to Marybridge Hospital and recovered there and was released the next day. Whereas the following individuals were involved in this program, we, the Metropolitan King County Council, recognize the lifeguards and staff at the Weyerhaeuser King County Aquatic Center for their extraordinary effort and successfully saving the life of a young athlete. So thank you very much. We're going to take any questions you might have, and then after this, we're going to take a, we're going to go up to the next diving board. And we're going to take a picture from up there and have you all on that board. 